Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today we'll be reviewing Combiner Wars Menace, aka the Stunticons. And we got all six of the team except for Break Wild Rider, aka Breakneck. I really need to get that to replace Off Road on the team. We're going to look at each Stunticon one by one. Transform them one by one, and then we're going to combine into Menasaur, the Stunicons. Let's start with my boy Breakdown. Oh, yeah, Breakdown in the house. And he rolls pretty well. And that's what he looks like underneath. You can see his hands, visible hand syndrome. From above, you can't even notice him. Got some nice molded wheels. Nice paint and sculpting on this Combiner Wars figure. Even the headlights are nicely molded. And he gets this gun, which is like a chainsaw, a cha chainsaw gun or a or a mach a blade gun, if you want to be specific. But now we're going to get down to transformation with our first Stunicon. Breakdown. Disconnect the legs. Like so. Fold this back. Fold up the arms like, like so. First you flip this part out to form the head. Connect the arm. Rotate the head. Second verse, just like the first. And on my copy, he's a bit tight. He's a tight breakdown. As soon as I can get him to split. And so far we got breakdown transformed. And look at that well molded body. Combiner Wars nailed breakdown. Down to the color scheme and everything. The gun ain't accurate to the Generation 1, but still, he can blast some Autobots and be like, Hello, Autobots. Time for a breakdown and break me down some Autobots. Ha 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 ha. Pew pew. <coughs> I'm sorry, I'm a bit sick, so I'm recovering. Next, we got Drag Strip. I didn't like the gun that originally came with Drag Strip, so I just gave him an, an extra... An extra Silver Bolt. Not Silver Bolt, but Bruticus gun. It was just looking better. Disconnect the arm. Like so. Now we're going to pull these out to form the legs. Split the legs. And there you got the lower body all done. Rotate this and peg this into the and Fold these arms up. Fold out the hands. 
And there we got Drag Strip. And he looks pretty cool. And now we're going to give Drag Strip a gun. So you go pew pew, bang bang, pew pew, bang bang. And that is Stunticon Drag Strip. Ready for battle. And not a bad looking drag strip for Combiner Wars. Next, we're going to look at my boy, Dead End. Flip down this. Disconnect the gun. Rotate these around. Fold in. Form the legs. Fold this down. Fold these up. The arms. Fold out the hands, which can be a little bit tricky. Rotate this around. Fold out the other hand. And there we got Dead End. And he's ready to cause some Autobots to meet their end. And he gets this weird pipe club, which is a thing with this figure. Next, we're going to transform is Off-Road. <coughs> Sorry, I'm going to be coughing quite a bit. But I'm doing my best to review this. But I am so far getting better. And rope puts these arms up. And he can be a bit tight, so you gotta be careful when handling him. So I gotta be careful when handling these, because on my copies, they're a little bit tight. Because they make these things so tight. Why do they do that? I do not know why they got to be so tight. And fold these up, and these become like weird shoulder pads. And here is Off Road with his axe ready to chop, chop up some Autobots. I'm Off Road, and I'm going to enjoy. Taking me down some Autobots with this. <laughs> it would be my pleasure, Megatron. And there we have half of the bots transformed. Next we got Little Combiner Wars Blackjack. And he's not a bad looking car. He's like a repaint of the Rodimus repaint but now we're going to transform him which is very simple just like Rodimus which I did a way long time ago here on this channel I just love me some Combiner Wars stuff and rotate this downwards to become the backpack Split the legs, and there we got Decepticon Blackjack. And he's like, I'm ready to take down some Autobots. Oh, yeah. Next, we got the leader of the Stunticon, Motormaster. And he rolls pretty well. After transformation, we're going to be getting down into combine mode. This will be a pretty 
experience video for anyone who hasn't seen Combiner Wars Menasaur before. Fold down the legs a bit. Disconnect these panels. Get your fingers in the panels right there. Fold them down. Straighten them out. Split the cab section like so. So they make that click noise. And push down to push out the head. Getting this to properly orient can be very tricky at times. Rotate down the feet. And there we got Motormaster in his glory. Give Motormaster his gun. And he's ready to go pew pew, bang bang, pew pew, bang bang. And give him his sword. And he is ready to go slash slash. Then he's ready to go slash 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 and that's why motormaster is the the head honcho of the studicons it's time for combine mode we've shown off each individual robot now it's time to bring on the combining the studicons into their big Form. Start with Motormaster, of course. And there we got Motormaster almost ready for combine mode. We're going to be flipping these panels up to secure the combine mode. And there we got one leg ready for combine mode. Now we got to get the other leg ready. And there we got Metasaur in torso, Motormaster in torso mode. If I can get him to properly to stand. I'll just lay him flat. Because he's being a bit of trouble. <laughs> We're going to make... Breakdown and Motormaster, a breakdown, a leg, I think. Wait, Off-Road becomes a leg and so does Dead End. <laughs> Sorry, I get confused easy. But yeah, they become legs. So we're going to put them back into vehicle mode for this transformation here. Which is just very simple. Cordy in the legs. Like so. Make sure everything folds in properly. And get one.
combiner wars hand foot gun plug it in to the foot and there we got the first leg ready to go first just like the first we're gonna transform drag not drag strip but wild rider into a leg Not Wild Rider, Dead End into a leg. Sorry. My head gets confused easy. My autism is really getting confused today. Depending if he's going to work properly, huh? Which so far he's working properly. And now we're going to bring in another combiner line mode foot gun. And there we got a leg mode all done. And we're going to have to pull out the, the port. Come on. And I finally got the 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 leg to cooperate. And there we got the legs ready to go and now let's combine. Manasaur is nearly ready for for some Autobot crushing. Manasaur online. <laughs> Autobot fools, you face the power of Manasaur. I will crush the Autobots. <laughs> he gets pretty tall, so next we're going to get ready for combined mode is Breakdown. We're going to have him become the other arm here. Hmm. Maybe it's going to be easier to have break down as a leg than than a uh, dead end because this leg is not long enough. This arm is not long enough. Sorry, dead end, you're being 
John has an arm. Because as a leg, leg, he'll do better. So yeah, <laughs> sorry about the hesitation for this review. But yeah, it's going to be some devastation for the Stunicons. Oh yeah. Okay. Plug the hand foot gun into break to break down. And now take him in to the to the port, the combiner port into the Menasaur's combiner port. Now that looks better. That looks intimidating and better. We're gonna give him a combined mode foot gun. Obviously that's the left hand. And give Menasaur his Huge blade of destruction and his blade of destruction. We're going to fold down the hand. Apparently, it doesn't want to connect. I think I'm just going to have to make a fan mode for this. If it doesn't want to connect properly, then that's a problem. Okay. Menasaur. Almost ready for battle. If I can get him to stay standing... Now we're going to have Blackjack become the chest here. Lower the camera and show you the transformation for Blackjack. And this is step by step and by memory. Because I'm that good with transforming figures. Connect this blade there and plug this in to Motormaster's chest. And now he's starting to look very G1 and intimidating. And we can store the weapons on here. I will show that off. I just stored the axe here. And Blackjack has a thing for popping loose on my copy. And there he goes again. <laughs> You're supposed to stay in there, chest minion. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Hey, stand in, Menasaur. Come on. You can get him in a lot of poses if you want him to. 
But given how fussy my copy is, he can be. Sorry that this has taken long. This will be a 25 minute video at best. Let's transform Dead End into his robot, into his arm mode. And I am just that good at remembering. And plug in the hand foot gun. Mm. And you could totally put the guns from the single robots in the combined hand foot gun as like extra blasters for Menasaur. And now we're going to fold the other hand down. And get ready to connect. Aw oh boy, drag strip. And he is almost all combined up properly. Except for... You know. <laughs> drag blackjack, so... But I'm going to see if I can straighten them out properly. Come on, you big behemoth. Come on. Stand properly, you big behemoth. And if you want to, you can use these panels to cover up the back if you want. Makes it seem like he's got a full back. And you can put this pipe weapon into the motor master hand for storage. Not a bad gimmick. If I do, say so myself. And we're gonna see if we can get Blackjack to stay in there. And now we're gonna push the combiner back to show you how tall this thing is. How tall Menasaur topples. Come on, Menasaur. Stay standing. Stay standing. Come on. Come on. Stay standing, boy. Don't you dare tip over. Over, I'm gonna... Whoa. I think I managed... Whoa. Menasaur, stand. He has tried trouble standing. With a bit of fuss. He... Come on. And there we have Menasaur in his robot mode. Just to show you how tall he is. Bring in a figure to show you how tall Combiner Wars Menasaur is next to another figure. He is taller than a Ghostbuster. Man, is that incredibly tall. He is taller than the female Ghostbuster, Abby Gates. Pretty tall, huh? Is a Combiner Wars Menasaur worth having in your collection if you're a Transformers enthusiast? Yes. Pick him up. He is a great-looking figure. And not a bad looking one, if I do say so myself. If you can find him on eBay for a good price, pick him up complete. But if you buy him individually, review it after you get all five of them. And I will try to get Breakneck to make this completely G1 accurate. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on. And rock on and rock out.